This one's gonna be for Arch Linux users. Um, this time I'm gonna use this program called DevTap, and let me give you uh, the description of it here. So basically, it's a script to convert uh, Deb uh, packages to Arch Linux packages. Uh, it's kind of like that program Alien, if you remember that video. I'll post you a link in the description if you want to learn uh, how to use Alien also. But Alien, it converts uh, RPM to Deb files. Um, so this one is similar to that, but this one does, you know, Deb files to Arch Linux files, right? So that's what we're going to do. Pretty simple. So I actually had a situation um, today. So I'm giving you an example here. I wanted to install this program called Task Pooler, which I made a video on that a long time ago also. Post you that in the description if you want to do that. Um, so this one is Task Pooler. The thing is, when you try to install this, it has a name conflict. So TS command here, right? That's for, for uh, Task Pooler. But there's actually another program called TS. And that's timestamp input. So there's a, a conflict of names, and so that's why I didn't build. Anyways, I was too lazy to learn how to, you know, make a, a build script or uh, edit it because I didn't know how to do it anyways. Um, so that's why I'm using DevTap, and I'll show you how to do that here. So first of all, you need to go find the packages. So we're gonna use this page here. Okay, this is called pkgs.org, and this basically it's you know Linux. Uh, packages search and they have it for like every distribution or I think all the major ones okay that has it so in here we just gonna search for the package that we want and search for task spooler and let's see what they got here uh, and then go to the system you want since we're doing uh, you know Debian uh, packages we had either use Debian or Ubuntu or Linux Mint or something like that so I'm gonna go to the Ubuntu because I know it has it um, in here and yeah there you go it's just uh, task puller and I'm using a 64 bit so I'm gonna use this one here All right click on that go down here click on this download and go down again and there you have there are dip files here so we're gonna click on that and it'll download it and we'll say keep and now we have it on our list here so this is the download that we just did right for the dev files uh really easy to use this program just call you know the name of it dev tap and then um the program name here or i mean the file name here of that dev file and you hit enter and now it says your uh enter the package your name you can give it any name you want i'm gonna put my name in there right or my alias i mean uh, enter and the license, really, you don't have to type in me, but we'll just say um, GNU. How about that? Enter. And now we just wait for it to build our script. It should take, uh, depending on what packages it is, this one takes about, um, I don't know, maybe a minute. So we'll wait for it here. But this is pretty cool if, you know, you're looking for a package and you don't want to waste time learning how to uh, write a build script. But one day I'm gonna learn how to write a uh, Arch Linux build script, but I didn't have the time to do it now. Anyways, that thing's finished here. And if you wanna edit the PKG info, you can do that. Otherwise, just hit enter to continue. And that's it, you're done. So now that we have our, um, what is that? This was our original, and then it converted to this one, the PKG tar.xz uh, here. And that's basically an Arch Linux uh, local file that you can actually install. So to install it, it's pretty easy. You do sudo pacman uh, dash capital U for upgrade, I believe. And then the package name, which is, um, what is that, task pooler here, dot tar dot uh, xz. And that's it. You type in your password. And it'll tell you you want to install this. And we'll say enter for yes. And there you go, you have task puller install, or I already had it installed, but we're reinstalling it. And that's how you do that. And to confirm this, you can do, um, we'll list it out, how about that? Pacman QQL, and then task puller is our package name. All right, uh, in this package, it has this program called TSP. And TSP is for task boiler. 
So you can confirm by doing a man TSP, right? And this is our task builder program. And that's how we have it on our system. Now, if you ever want to, um, you know, delete it later on, you can't really search for it because if you install it locally, I'm not sure why it doesn't show up, but if we search for task spooler, say it doesn't show up, um, but you can still uninstall it by doing sudo pacman, what's that, uh, dash r, capital R I mean, and then task spooler is the package name, and you say yes, we'll say enter, and it removes it, right? So that's how you install it and remove it and convert it um, if you ever needed to. Obviously, that's not the, the best way to do it, but if you're in a hurry and you just want the package and you know it exists on another system, on a Debian system or something like that, then you can use this uh, to convert it real quick. Anyways, that's it for this one.